ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike here at Game From Scratch, and it is the first Tuesday of the month, and you regulars know what that means. It is time for free Unreal Engine stuff. To be honest, I wasn't 100% certain that this one was going to happen, but thankfully it did. The reason for my uncertainty is uh, Epic Games have announced they are moving to the Fab Asset Store uh, later on this month. So October, uh, they are going to be moving over to Fab. So I did not know what was going to happen with the giveaway. So I wouldn't be surprised that things change a little bit come the next month. What we're looking at right now, this is the first of the free assets. Basically, the way this works is you buy these, they are yours to keep forever. Air quotes around the word buy because it doesn't cost you any money. Uh, so even if you are not using Unreal Engine, you should be picking these up because you're getting a ton of stuff for free over the years. We've had probably tens of thousands of free assets given away, and we've had at least 30 of these, probably much more than that in terms of giveaways. First asset we are looking at here right now is the stylized Paris Street. Now, you've probably actually seen this one before, and on my channel, you may have actually seen it in a weird way. And that may look familiar to you, because I actually used the contents for this particular level. It was in a Humble Bundle in the past, I think. Uh, and I exported them out to the Godot game engine and used them for the lighting. By the way, on the topic of the Godot game engine, uh, there's actually a new plugin available for the Unreal game engine, uh, the Unreal to Godot exporter. I covered this one earlier on, on September the 25th. If you missed the coverage of that, I highly recommend checking out that video. It is a powerful tool that makes the idea of moving contents like this over to uh, other engines super, super easy. So if you want to go ahead and check that one out, there will be a link to it down below. So yeah, even if you are not using Unreal Engine, I highly recommend get your inner hoarder on and just keep acquiring all of these assets. And hopefully we keep getting them uh, into uh, next month when we go live with Fab. I do not know what's going to happen yet, but it is great to hear we have something this month. So that is the first asset. That is the stylized Paris Street. Next up, we have the Temples of Cambodia. So this is the ruins exterior and interior. I have a feeling this is a photogrammetry scam of actual Cambodian uh, ruins. You can see the outside of it over here. Uh, I don't know if we can go down in. So you got the inside. It's just very um, hard to see. So let's... Uh, Let's just jack the exposure up a little bit here so we can see the insides here. Again, when you move between uh, the earlier versions of Unreal Engine and the light, now light is super bloomed there. That's gone a little too high. Let's go a little bit in the middle here. You can see the lighting model is definitely seemingly shifted between versions. So you got all the interior spaces of this. Uh, and as you'll see, there's actually another asset in this bundle this week that almost feels like an extension of this particular asset. So this is the interior of the... Uh, of the ruins here, we'll go back on the outside there, you can see the exterior aspect of it. Uh, I don't think there is another level, but let's go check. So I think demo, maps. Oh yeah, so we have the interior volume here. Let's open that one up and check that out. So here we see specifically the inside. Let's find our post-process volume over here. Lower that down quite a bit. So here you can see inside of said temple all of the stuff going on over here. Uh, again, the lighting is not being my friend. And then go back over here. Here are the overview of the assets. Let's open that one up quickly. And here you can see all of the pieces that go together. Again, I, I wouldn't be surprised that this one is photogrammetry, uh, but I'm not 100% not certain on that. But if you're looking to create uh, Cambodian caves, that is what this map is all about. Again, very high detail. Uh, so, so, and if you know why uh, lighting changes so drastically with Unreal Engine like 5.3 and 5.4, please do let me know in the comments down below. It's one of the downsides with these asset packs is they're shared across multiple different versions. And if the lighting model changed, well, there's not much you can do about that. This next one is super straightforward uh, and also incredibly bloomed out. But what you see here, this is the rocket thrusters exhaust effects. Now, I don't know if this is a 5.4 thing or if it's just a side effect of having so many particle systems going and they're kind of the lighting are blending across each one. You'll notice if you grab and select one of these things, uh, you have a number of settings for them. Let me just go ahead and find one of these things right here. So you will see, for example, you got control over how the, uh, how the rocket effects should work. Let's grab another one over here. Uh, same thing, oh, so it's down here the plumes that these rockets generate uh, entirely driven by a niagara you have control over a variety of different settings for each one so that is it uh, if you need to have uh, variable controlled custom uh, controlled rocket thrusters that is what this pack is all about very straightforward asset 
Next up, we have the Fantasy Characters Pack. Now, this is a collection of characters like so. Uh, you've got this guy with incredibly small thighs, um, and then a number of pieces of equipment to equip them all going on around here, and then a variety of animations. Let's go ahead and play this one. Uh, there is a uh, blueprint that is currently missing, uh, a character controller blueprint. Um, you're going to have to resolve that if you want to use the samples, but everything else should work just fine. So you can see here, they're fully armored and armed. Uh, we've got a variety of different animations for these guys as we go through. So we've got kind of an orc-looking guy here, another orc-looking guy here, and then over here we've got kind of a werewolf-looking guy, a, a human rogue-looking type, some mercenaries and so on and then we got this uh, rock golem looking thing and then we have a variety of different animations that correspond with our characters in this pack like so so that is the uh, fantasy characters pack and then we have one final asset like i said earlier this one feels a whole lot like the earlier one this is the cave ruins there's 47 assets total in here again we do come down to a bit of an exposure issue but let's go through take a quick look at it with its default lighting. So you see everything going down here uh, and a variety of different settings. We got some chests going on down there. And I believe if I go up these stairs over here, and we got kind of a gated dungeon area over there. Like so, and then we have, uh, this is where King Arthur left his sword. Again, you may want to change the, uh, the exposure values a little bit depending on the kind of environment you're working with, but that is just for the demo levels. Shouldn't matter for the majority of people, but that one there is the Cave Ruins, uh, and let's just do a quick look at the overview map on that one. So this is the Cave Ruins overview map, and you see 47 assets go together to create that environment like this, including this incredibly happy-looking skeleton who is not having a bad day at all. Uh, so that is the last of the assets. So a quick recap, we've got the stylized Paris streets asset. We have the uh, temples of Cambodia ruins exterior and interior. We have rocket thruster exhaust effects. We have the fantasy characters pack. And finally, we have the cave ruins 47 assets pack. Now, again, way you pick these up, go to the free, free for the month. They should all be there. Now I say this. Uh, cautioning because I don't actually know what's going to happen it, with fab taking over this month this process might change entirely but what you basically do come through grab the five assets add them to your cart check out and then they are yours to keep forever and again a reminder you saw these can be used in other engines and also there is a new tool that makes that incredibly easy do check that out in the comments down below uh, for details on that one but let me know what you think of this month's assets what is your favorite and that's it. I will talk to you all later. Hopefully this works out fine. If the instructions are a little bit different because Fab came online, can't be helped. And it'll be interesting to see if I will be back next month with you for another similar giveaway or if there will be something completely different because right now, I honestly don't know. All right, that's it. I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.